Hello and welcome to the next video in this collection update series. So this is basically just a series in which I am converting some of my collections to smaller binders and you can find the introduction video in this series that has a way more information either up above or linked down below. I'll also link every other part in this series but yes as mentioned we are now entering part five did i say that earlier did i say four i don't remember but this is part five um and it is a monster x i'm sure you can clearly tell and this binder is from that same store that i mentioned in the previous one star pop shop um is their etsy so you can either shop on etsy or they have like an actual storefront they are based in canada so i guess the etsy kind of helps with um People outside of Canada maybe I'm not really too certain I I order from the actual like store store but I will link everything down below um, I do want to compare this one for a second with the one from the previous video so this one as you can see is purple and sparkly very cute whereas the one that I use for my BTS collection is clear with sparkles some purple accents so yeah two different options if you want to get some purple binders. I don't know if there's any others, but there might be. So highly recommend checking out the store. But yeah, so these are just the two variations of purple that I purchased, but wanted to do a quick comparison. In the previous video, I did also show the difference in sizing of these binders compared to the ones that I have on Amazon. So you can go ahead and check that out if you want to see a comparison between those two. But without further ado, let's just get into this. So we have my updated Monster X collection. I have um, a pretty decently extensive uh, Juhan collection. It's not like crazy thorough but it's all album cards and quite a few other like non-album things i don't really do pre-order benefits for mod sticks too much but yeah basically everything i have is in here so we're just going to take a quick little look now i mentioned in the previous video that these pages are actually double slotted so you can put two cards where they won't actually touch each other because there's a piece of plastic in the middle so um for these because i knew i had a lot of photo cards that i needed to fit in here i did put them back to back so we will not be seeing the backs of these photo cards this time around but i think i'm okay with it because monster x's backs of their cards at least in the earlier eras were all pretty much the same just different colors so i don't mind too much i would have loved to be able to see the back of them but just trying to fit them all in here is a little difficult so here is the first page and then we move on and I actually you know what? it's not that bad because you get to see like a big spread of Juhan's face and I really like that so yeah Monstex does have a lot of albums and a lot of photo cards per well maybe not early years but like they moved on to multiple cards and album pretty quick so <laughs> there's a lot here there's a glare on Juhan so I'm gonna bring this down a little bit in hopes that you can see him a little bit better there sorry my lighting isn't exactly phenomenal but there we go that's a little better um i love the red hair so much but my favorite has got to be the blue hair and we're about to see some more oh love it yeah i think blue is just perfect for him so <laughs> and then we continue this is where the backs of the card started to change a little bit but it's okay we don't need to see everything and then here's some more i have mixed in is that mm, is the key there's a kino in here this one shoot i don't remember but i have mixed in the kinos as you can see i have a spot for the newest one which i didn't have for the longest time i didn't buy the kino but i found the card on mercari for a decent price so he is on the way um and then we move into japanese cards i i was pretty good with keeping up to them keeping up with them for a little while and then i kind of stopped and i don't think i really care to continue purchasing them in the future so that's what i got and then we move into special juhan photos as you can see here i think some of these are pre-order benefits and fan signs and then we move into like non-album stuff here it still remains to be one of my favorite juhan non-album photo cards and here are these i kind of want to put these here instead now that i'm looking at it but i'll do that on my own time and then we have the um <laughs> okay so victon just released stuffed animals and it's tony mini and that's just like the only name that's coming into my head right now what the heck were these called again two took them oh my gosh i was like literally it just was not coming to me but these are all the cars from their two took um line i have the little juhan 
plushy. Ooh, let's get back in there. There we go. I find the cards kind of slip out of these a little bit too, so just something to keep in mind. I think the other pages are a little longer in my other binder, so they don't feel like they're about to fly out, but yeah. Then we have some unit photo cards. I used to collect Kihun as well. I'm sure a lot of you know that, but I recently decided to part ways with my Kihun collection, but it did go to a great home. One of my friends is a hard Kihun stand, so I did end up getting a lot of those cards to go to her. So that's always nice. But yeah, so I always collected unit cards with Juhan and Kihun. And then in this era, they weren't together, but I, I wanted both of them at the time. So I got them all. Um, I did uh, since sell the Kihun units though. And then yeah, it just kind of continues. There is one more unit card of theirs that I would like to own and that's a little spot for it. But for the most part, my Monstax collection is complete in all its Juhong glory. So <laughs> there is that. And um, yeah, there's still two more collection update videos, right? Is it two? Yes, two more coming your way. So do stay tuned for that. I hope you enjoyed this one and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.